Hi, I'm Jacqueline. And I'm Kevin. And this is The, the Big, Big Show. Show. Attention seniors, Ms. Lovin will be available during parent-teacher conferences to help you and your parents complete the FAFSA and college apps. Make sure to stop by and see her for help. Be nice. Are you interested in helping others, promoting a positive school climate, and putting an end to bullying? Holland Early College is starting a Be Nice Leadership Group. Students interested in the group should see Ms. Loveland. An upcoming two-hour training will be held on no uh, November 16th. Listen to this message from Ms. Mihal about the paper room. Listen here. Here's what the heck is happening. I can't compress my feelings into 10 seconds. Holland Early College, I'm coming to you from the paper room. Got an email from our building maintenance person that the paper room was a mess and I came down expecting like a few pieces of construction paper and instead I found this. Um, I think the room speaks for itself. Um, I can't explain the level of disappointment, the, the lack of trust, respect, responsibility. Um, and I think these images speak for themselves. And so my question is, what is happening? Um, is this who we are? Is this how we want our school? Um, and I, I'm kind of at a loss for words to be real honest, but this is not okay. Okay, so as Ms. Mihal was saying, this is very disappointing as you can see. We just want to point out is that you don't do this at home and if you did, well, your parents wouldn't be too happy. So we are blessed to go to school in this building. We know that at Holland High, we don't have these kind of this kind of freedom. So we just want to take use of it. Just be responsible and respectful of the space that we have. So, as Ms. Mihal was saying, people have been asking about trust cards, and after seeing this, she doesn't want to bring them back. So if you want trust cards, then you should probably keep this cleaner and keep every other place in the building cleaner. I'd say, like, most likely yes, because uh, I do see kids working hard, and I'd say just a little bit of no, because kids are goofing off and speaking of how the paper was wrecked and ruined and they don't, some kids don't pick up after themselves after lunchtime. We are not being respectful to our school because we are trashing rooms and not being respectful to teachers. This is a serious issue and all of us must take care of the paper room. On a lighter note, let's go to my man's Jair and Ryan for Student of the Week. Pick for Student of the Week is Sienna Crenshaw. She is a very caring person and helps her fellow students if they're not understanding material. She's also a very hard worker. She gets her assignments in on time with high quality work. She also is very compassionate. The student of the week for ninth grade this week is Sarah Den Blaker, and she is a really good leader in her group. She's a strong writer. Uh, she writes with some imagination. She's the kind of person who asks good questions in class, and she is all the time just sort of staying on top of things and doing quality work. My student of the week for 10th grade is Jamari Hawkins. Uh, he's a very hard worker. He's always engaged in asking questions. Um, if he doesn't understand something 100%, he makes sure that he leaves the room knowing 100%. He always helps people around him, so I always appreciate that as well. Um, keep up the good work, Jamari. My student week is Ariana Fortune. Um, she's been an exceptional student. I've known her for a couple years now and she's been a great art student and now I have her in my government class. Um, she did very well. She placed second in our My Party Election 16 and but she's just been keep on doing great stuff for me. This week's Student of the Week, I'm going to pick Rhea Shine. She's a senior. Um, the reason I chose her is because I always feel when she's working in a group, she's kind of the glue that holds it together. Um, she's able to work with anyone and everyone's always willing to work her, with her. 
So she's not always the loudest person, but that doesn't mean she's not always doing things right and she's a great person to work with. Congrats to those for Student of the Week. Great job. November is coming soon and so are some birthdays. Wish them happy birthday when you have the chance. Jacqueline, taking a wild guess here, I'm assuming you use emojis all the time? Oh yeah. Let's go with my angel and Rihanna to guess that emoji. Corn dog. <laughs> uh, French kiss. Uh, autumn? Fall? Yeah, that's Taco Bell. Ding, 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 ding. Coffee break. Right. American basketball? Fail. <laughs> A telephone po uh, You know those telephone... <sighs> I can't name it. iPhone. Oh. What's your favorite emoji to use? Oh, I keep it with me all the time. Hang on, let me show you. You carry that around with you? Why wouldn't I? As do I. <laughs> well, Queer of the Week should be interesting. Assuming you like to eat crickets. Totally, it's $100,000. I don't care if they were dead, alive, covered in chocolate, that's a lot of money. So yeah. I ate crickets when I was little, so. Yes, I would eat a bowl of crickets for $100,000. Yep. No. Bruh. I would not eat a bowl of crickets because for $1,000, no, it's very disgusting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, crickets are gross. Would you eat a bowl of crickets for $100,000? Uh, no, never. That's disgusting. And now, an ad from yearbook. What's up, Guillermo? Hey, bro. How are you? Good, are you? I'm good. Have you bought the yearbook yet? No, how much does it cost? $25. Isn't that awesome? Really? Yeah. That's far cheaper than last year. Mm-hmm, I know, right? Hey, also, are you uploading any pictures to the yearbook Snap app? What's the Snap app? The yearbook snap app is where you download pictures of you and your friends. Because last year I didn't see you in there at all. Uh, what's the username? The passcode is Dutch, all lowercase. Well, I'll make sure to up upload lots of photos of me and my friends outside. I know, that'd be awesome. I would love to see you in there. I know, who wouldn't love to see you? Yeah, I know. Hey, you gonna upload that to the snap app? Yeah, I will. Awesome. Nice. Hope to see you there. That's awesome. Yo, That's cool. Yo, who took this picture though? Go to the app store and download the yearbook snap app today. Get your pictures in your yearbook. The school is Holland Early College and the password is Dutch. Start submitting pictures of you and your friends. School appropriate pictures only. Thank you, Holland Early College. This has been The Big Show. Tune in next week. That's it? Rip, we didn't put the- You deleted it, didn't you? I did it. there was nothing there. <laughs> you carry that around. <laughs> oh, this was a terrible idea.